Hey guys, welcome back. Me here, Barry, with another video for you. And today this video is really all about the hybrid racing short shifter for the 9th gen Civic Si. I installed it a couple days ago, over the weekend, and I figured I'd let you guys know how I feel about it. If you're new to the channel and you're enjoying this video, don't forget to give it a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. And keep coming back for more info. Now, I drive a 2014 Honda Civic Si, putting out about 410 wheel horsepower, 320 foot pounds of torque. Now, I paired it with a very short gear ratio, the M Factory gear ratio. And the reason why I'm telling you this is because I spend a lot of time shifting thanks to this. I'll show you right now. If you didn't notice, that was a skip gear from first to third. There is so much torque, there is some, so little gearing. I mean, the gears, they're so short, they make Napoleon look like an NBA player, man. I went ahead, picked up this hybrid racing shifter simply because my old shifter, the stock shifter, was feeling kind of dull. And I've heard very good things about it. So I figured why not try it. I also paired it with, with the hybrid racing shift knob just to freshen up the car a little bit. Why not? I'll tell you a little bit about the shifter itself. The install. Pretty straightforward, pretty easy. I managed to get it done in about two hours or so. And that's mainly because I didn't do much of my homework. Now the shifter itself, it's a beautiful piece, fine quality. I went with the red one. I love the color red. The shifting itself though has been a complete game changer. have this shifter in your car if you're sort of on the fence about whether you might get this um, you should just do yourself a favor next time you get that stimulus check treat yourself for something nice this is an unbelievably great modification for this car I honestly I filled it up yesterday just to go out and romp on it because I didn't realize I've been going out for driving it has sort of really that fire that I, I love driving a manual car now like I did the first time I got into it kind of wasting gas like crazy these days shifts themselves are very crisp very precise it's solid but not exactly notchy and uncomfortable you just go through shifts really easily and I do a ton of shifting I'm telling you I do a ton of shifting in this car there I'll put it in six because I'm cruising at 40 miles an hour already and the downshifts forget it smooth give me a lot more confidence in my shifting in my downshifting especially the downshifting department everything is so close by there's no slop you're in gear you're in gear there's there's just no moving around and hybrid racing is a company that's been around forever I mean I I left the Honda scene 15 years ago and hybrid racing was there so for me, getting back to modifying Hondas and, and making them go fast and, and reconnecting with hybrid racing, it sort of just, you know what I mean? It just gelled. It's, it's right there. But why don't I just take a moment to let the car do the talking?
settings for the shifter is that you can adjust. You can adjust the, uh, the throw, how short or long the throw is. You can adjust the height of the shifter. I like the shifter and the knob as close to me as possible. But I hope you guys enjoyed my review. This has been a really fun video to record. so precise so good i cannot begin to explain to you how happy i am driving this car now but this shifter is literally asking begging me to get into trouble that's how good it is i like to think of myself as, as a semi-responsible person Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was useful for you if you're looking to make this purchase and add it to your uh, to your build. And if you like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I try to bring you guys, I don't know, content that is either entertaining, funny, useful. So if any of those categories match your liking, go ahead and subscribe. Until next time, guys, I'll see you later.